All right, I'm here with Mike from Velamin. You may know this company as the biggest producer of kits in the world, and he has an unannounced prototype to show off to us today. It's an oscilloscope that uses a tablet as the display wirelessly. Tell us about it, Mike. Okay, so here's a device. It's uh, basically a two-channel oscilloscope. Um, the nice thing is that it connects to any uh, tablet, either Android or um, I, uh, iOS, and you can even connect it to your PC, and it connects wireless. So that's very interesting because it's uh, very safe. If you do something wrong, you will not destroy your tablet. Okay, so this is the device. It has two inputs. It also has USB for charging and also to update the firmware. And basically it's just an on-off switch. That's it. Now if I turn it on, this is going to be the interface. So it's your basic oscilloscope. Two channels, it has readout, it has markers. You can choose whatever you like, uh, channel, uh, slope, uh, triggering, and you can control it the way you control your tablet, like this. Or if I change the amplitude, I can do it like this. So the learning curve to use this device is not, not steep at all. And the nice thing is that we um, provide the communication protocol between this unit and the tablet, so it's, it's kind of open source. So we hope that the community will make a lot of applications for this uh, device. Oh, so you're saying you're publishing the, the information in case someone wants to um, catch the signals coming off of the hardware and use it on their own front end? Of course. Of oh, course. that's fantastic. What about um, the tablet application? Can you export waveforms and, and uh, that sort of thing? Yes, you can. You can make, make screenshots or you can uh, export uh, the data. Um, and does it have any kind of uh, uh, interpretation? So if you capture a signal, can it uh, tell you what type of signal it is, that sort of thing? At this time, it cannot. We hope that the community will write a number of uh, applications that will do that. And you mentioned that there was a USB port for charging. Is There's an internal battery in this? There's an internal rechargeable battery. Uh, you can also con connect it to the, to the PC through the USB port in case you don't want to use it wireless. Oh, that's excellent. Um, now, you said it's not, it's just entering production now. Yes. Any idea how long it might take um, to someone could get their hands on this equipment? Uh, this is a, the first production run, and uh, we believe we're going to have stock in like two or three months. Oh, that's great. What's the bandwidth of this? It's a 2 times 10 megahertz uh, unit, so for most applications that's uh, more than enough. Excellent. If people want to learn more about it, is there anything published yet, or do you know where it will be published? Uh, it'll be on our website, so www.veloman.be. Great. Well, thank you so much for showing us this. You're welcome.